Another interesting question was, is there an extended release calcium? Hi, I'm Dr. Margie Egan with Just Between You and Me with Dr. Margie. I'm an endocrinologist with over 30 years of practice. It's a pain in the butt to have to take something three times per day. I did so much research, research on this question, guys, and I still am confused about all the information I got. So my medical opinion is, if I can't understand it as an endocrinologist who has specialized in osteoporosis, I would tell you it's not worth the extra cost, probably. What I found was they work by slowing the absorption to reduce the GI side effects. So if you're having GI side effects due to regular calcium, yes, maybe try this. But they don't improve the calcium absorption or the bioavailability over immediate release Forms. So I found a brand, Citrocal XR, it says it has 1,200 milligrams of calcium, and you should only take it once a day. But I talked to you about citrate, calcium citrate only has 21% of elemental calcium. So that means you're only absorbing 250 milligrams of elemental calcium from that extended release. So you really, in my mind, would need to take two of those calcium tablets twice a day and then take an extra one at night to get you to 1450. So they tout it as you only have to take it once a day, the Citrocal XR, but they're not letting you know that you are then still at a substandard dose of calcium. So that's my two cents for that. I think it's too complicated and gives people a false sense that they're getting all the calcium they need.